Another easy coverage to go over, comprehensive. Uh, so this is gonna cover you for a loss in um, a bunch of weird situations. Uh, so let's say your car uh, gets, uh, say it gets flooded, uh, which definitely happens around here, blah, 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 blah. Uh, now it looks like a boat. <laughs> um, if you have comprehensive coverage and your car gets flooded or it gets hailed on, or uh, let's say a tree falls on it, this is a tree falling over. Any of these weird situations, if you hit an animal, by the way, um, you uh, can collect that. That's a bunny? I don't know what that is. But anyway, collision or uh, comprehensive coverage is what covers the other things that can happen to your vehicle. I like to think about it as uh, collision coverage is you hit something, comprehensive coverage is something hit you. Now, not another driver, not another vehicle, but something. So, uh, hail, this would also be theft, uh, vandalism, all of those things that it's just sort of a catch all of things that could happen to your vehicle. Um, and that's why they call it comprehensive. Just like with collision coverage, you have a deductible. Uh, in some cases, you can have a $0 deductible all the way up to 2000 plus, some of them get that high. Just like with comprehensive or a collision coverage, if you are financing your vehicle, they'll probably only let you go up to $1,000. So keep that in mind. The standard is 500, although I'm seeing a lot better prices on um, these deductibles. So I'm starting to look more into $250 deductibles. Uh, just it, you're paying pennies more uh, a month to have that coverage that low. Um, and it just, you, you're going to benefit from it when something happens because the way things have been going, you are probably going to have a comprehensive claim uh, pretty soon. So anyway, that's it. Comprehensive. Other stuff happening to your car.